Amber Heard, how are you? I'm doing great. I'm doing wonderful. wonderful. Now you play Mira in the new film Aquaman. Such a fun film, so crazy, <laughs> and I'm here for it. Thank you. Um, Thank my you. first question is something that I was just thinking the whole time during the movie, which is there's so many scenes where you and Jason, Mira and Aquaman, are walking in and out of water, and you're just kind of soaked all the time. And I was just wondering, practically on set, how were they, were they just throwing buckets of water at you all the time? Yeah, I had a little booth. It looked like a, like a, it looked like a large cat box of some sort. You know, okay. it had a small grate on it, and I would stand on my box, on my grate, and they would quite literally. Uh, Throw buckets of water on me. Uh, I mean, really? I, yeah. There was no hose that could reach into the. Uh, when we we're outside, it was a hose <laughs> attached to a pump. But the but in studio because it's quite messy, and I'm staying on a box that had to come from above. And so, look, it's not lost on me that my job as an adult grown woman often entailed showing up to work after a 10, 11 hour break to work another 18 hour a day and it's five o'clock in the morning after three hours of hair and makeup and wardrobe and I'm standing on a box freezing in an airline or an empty airline hangar in the middle of Australia getting hosed down. Fun, fun times. To start times. my day at work. There were a few scenes where you and Jason were walking like under waterfalls. I was thinking I bet they hated that. I bet that was a rough moment. It's rough, it's rough because that water is cold mm. And also, just the way, the nature of the suit, the material of the suit. I mean, water falling down vertically in my suit that's only open here. Sure. I'd say it was less than fun because where does, that, where does that water go? Yeah. It's not the most scientific suit, is it? I don't want, I wouldn't, that wouldn't be the first adjective that came Sure, to sure, sure. Now, uh, Mira is um, quite an active character. She's not like a damsel in distress. She's saving Aquaman half the time. So you must have done quite a lot of training. Did you do any like water training? We did very little water training because really the extent of my water training should be just how do you cope sure. with being hosed down for a living uh, to start your day as an adult woman uh, and deal with that and still act. I mean, there are so many scenes involving rain, involving coming in and out of the water that just basically required endurance, mm -hmm. patience, and I don't know what else. Uh, that was the extent of the water training. However, the physical training I trained for uh, you know, five or more hours a day wow. for probably five months before even going to Australia where we had additional uh, training and then, you know, through the first few months of filming every day. So it was, it was extensive. That's intense. It was a full-time job. Now we've got Mira, <laughs> we've got uh, Nicole Kidman playing Atlanta. Now we've also got Gal Gadot in the wings. Yes. Bring them together, we could have ourselves some kind of female justice league. Now, would you be on board? And also, what would you want that to, to look like? I would not want to be a person who had an answer for what I wanted it to look like. Okay. Would I be on board? Hell yes. Yeah. The fact that there isn't one already is kind of amazing, and there needs to be more of us. Definitely. I mean, we do make up half the population, like of humans, so Small why not? Small detail, isn't it? I mean, As kind, well. of, kind of, kind of well, makes sense. Amber Heard, thank you so much. Aquaman is in cinemas on the 12th of December. Yeah. And that's true. <laughs> nice cool. to meet you.